not understanding MSDS can result in fatal conditions. In next 5 minutes, we will learn how to avoid this situation. Hello everyone. Through this video, today we will learn about what is MSDS. What is MSDS? A material safety data sheet is a document that contains information on the potential hazards like health, fire, reactivity and environmental and how to work safely with the chemical product or we can say a MSDS is a written document that outlines information and procedures for handling and working with chemicals. Now what is use of MSDS? An MSDS will tell what the hazard of the chemical are and how they should clean it up to keep everyone safe. Now what are the purposes of MSDS? First, identification of the product and supplier. Second, hazard, physical on health. Third, prevention. In which what steps you have to take to prevent all the hazards or exposure from that chemical and last is response then what appropriate responses you have to take or a first aid measures you have to take if you get exposed with any of the chemical so these are the purposes of MSTS first is identification hazard prevention and response so you always have to keep all this in mind while working with any chemical. Material safety data sheet list beta in chlorhexidin D125 renalin D256 spirit or alcohol liquid paraffin sodium hypochlorite citric acid and many more. Chemical handling required properly written chemical name. There should be a proper chemical name written on the chemical canes. Second concentration. Concentration is very important because you have to dilute it. So if you know about the concentration of that chemical written on the chemical cans, it will help you to make the better dilution. Third date of manufacture. It should always be written on the chemical canes. Last date of expiry, which is very important. Before using any chemical, it is your duty to check for the date of expiry of any chemical, whether it is expired or not. If the chemical is expired, then you have to discard it. Now what are the contents of MSTS sheet? First, name of hazardous material. Flammability status, chemical nature, purpose, side effect, first aid measures or measurements, storage, handling and transportation, and last, spill and disposal procedures. Lastly, what points to be remembered? First, the hazardous material and waste management system will be overseen and reviewed annually by the Emergency Preparedness and Safety Committee to ensure that all materials are handled in a safe manner. Second, the center will maintain material safety data sheet for all chemicals used within their department. Third, the MSDS book must be continually updated as new chemicals are introduced and will be updated at least annually. Fourth, the MSDS book must be accessible to all concerned. It is necessary to request a material safety data sheet whenever ordering any chemical. And last, all hazardous material will remain at the store. If you have any doubt or a query, Please do connect with the clinical department as clinical team is always present for you. Thank you.